welcome back. All right, some creepy crawlers may give us the chills just looking at them. Ooh. But there are a lot of bug friends doing a lot of good for nature and the world. Yep. In today's Metro Parks Monday, mm -hmm. we're looking ahead to an event allowing young scientists to celebrate all things insect. Joining us now <laughs> is Bethany Majeski. She's uh, at the Nature Center. She's a manager of yep. the Nature Center at the Cleveland Metro Parks, the uh, Chagrin, North Chagrin Reservation. I want to check in with her right now to tell us more about this big uh, bug extravaganza that's going on. Bethany, good to see you. Good morning. <laughs> Good morning, Wayne. Good morning, Stephanie. How are you today? We are good. So you have some great little critters to talk about. Kids are fascinated by bugs. I remember my kids, they wanted jewelry that we could buy at places like that with that like had bugs and tarantulas and they wanted them on their neck. Like, like kids just love <laughs> to look at bugs and they want to keep them in their little kits and stuff yes. like that. But there's so much to learn. Yeah, love them or hate them, bugs are definitely fascinating. Yes. Um, and we've got a whole bunch coming up that you can check out here at North Chagrin Nature Center on July 31st. We're gonna have our annual bug extravaganza. It's a celebration of everything buggy. It's a free family-friendly event from 1 to 4 p.m. Um, you're gonna get to see some really cool critters up close, and there's a lot of activities um, really for little ones. So you can come out and step into a butterfly tent. You can see live insects up close. You can splash in our aquatic insect pool. And you can even eat a cricket if you're really, really brave. Yeah, I really hear. Uh, it's huh? great for young families, but. You have some snacks that we kids do, can eat we a do. cricket, right? Yes, they can eat a cricket. <laughs> Let me ask you this, Bethany. Uh, what, what, uh, what importance are, are, are bugs when it comes to nature? Yeah, so we tend to um, over -estim or underestimate the value of insects mm -hmm. in our world. We kind of see them and want to say, ooh, get away from me. But right. they're actually very useful. So everything from pollination to um, helping to control some other pests there are a lot of insects and spiders and other creepy crawlies who will um, kind of take care of things that we don't want, like mosquitoes. Mm -hmm. So they are very useful to us, and they're important for the ecosystem. So it's good to kind of overcome those fears of the creepy crawly, get familiar with some of our um, local insects here, and some of them are really beautiful and fascinating too. Uh, we have a monarch caterpillar here. Wow. This is one of everybody's favorites. Mm -hmm. Monarchs are famous for that migration across North America. They go all the way to Mexico. Can you imagine a butterfly flying all the way to Mexico? Um, but they start out here as just these tiny little caterpillars and they do grow and get bigger and they will only eat one kind of plant. So that's kind of part of our education piece is not only learn about these cool insects, but what you could do at home, like plant milkweed to help support them. Well, that's just the thing, because if that would run out, then of course we wouldn't have these beautiful monarch uh, butterflies. So let's talk real quick. These. We just want to remind everyone, bug extravaganza is happening North Chagrin Nature Center. That's on Sunday, and it's just one day from one to four. And again, it's free admission. And also you have the Squires Castle camp out and that is going to be super cool coming up uh, the following weekend on August 5th. Yes, yeah, so um, you know if you woke up like me this morning you realize you looked at the calendar and there's only a month of summer left oh, no. before kids have to go back to uh -huh. school but that's why you know we have so many great things still to enjoy this summer so besides bug extravaganza we do have on August 5th at North Chagrin Reservation you can come with your family and camp out and we do all this stuff for you you can rent a tent through us um, we'll start the fire we'll get your s'mores going we'll take you on a hike you'll get to meet some animals do some different activities so there's just so much to do and enjoy. If you don't love bugs, come out and camp with us instead. Oh, that is awesome. <laughs> well, we can't wait. We're happy you're talking about the bugs and Wayne and I are not in studio eating bugs like we have been for the last 20 some years. No, so no. thank you for giving us a break <laughs> from having wings and little feet and legs in our teeth. Right, we appreciate it. <laughs>
Happy to spare you that. Okay, yeah. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> I mean, I don't know. I, am I speaking for myself, or no, do you want no, some no, bugs? Because no, you're really quiet. I, I agree Would wholeheartedly. You like some? I, no, I'm good. We could go pick you up some. I'm good. I'm good. Put a little barbecue sauce on it, though. You know, I may change my mind. Cricket brownies. I think they've baked they've brownies with some of those over things the years. in there. <laughs> they've had everything in here. Right. Uh, I remember us going, we did not go to journalism <laughs> school for this. That's for sure. <laughs> but kids can taste them and eat them. Parents can, too, because they'll have cricket Absolutely. snacks on hand. Well,